Good morning. Good morning. It is currently 8.21. Actually, we did good because we wanted to like be in working out at 8.30. Slay. Guys, Ashley's back in the vlog. Ashley's back in the vlog. She and we're back at the gym. It's like old times. It is like old times. You were traveling. You went to tell them where you went. Oh my gosh, I went to Africa for my friend's wedding. It's one of those weddings that you always wanted to get invited to. It was in Cape Town? It was in Cape Town for the start of it. And then we ended up in Hotspur at one point, And then we ended up in Kapama for a safari. They had a whole tour guide. He That's planned cool. the whole thing. So like, I didn't have to think, I just showed up on time. Mm -hmm. Like everything was like booked and like prepaid and so easy. The only bummer was I was super sick. I was planning on vlogging and I didn't because I was oh, super didn't. sick. That makes yeah. sense. That I makes brought sense. like my camera and everything and I didn't. So I took a lot, as many reels as I could, <laughs> but I ended up not vlogging. Oh, I was gonna I was say go watch bad. your vlog, but go watch her reels. <laughs> Workout is done. I feel great and I need to remember this moment the next time I don't want to work out. I just walked on the treadmill for like an hour and I feel great. But then there's days where I'm like, I don't want to go. I'm like, Alicia, go. You always feel great after. Always feel great after. But before we shower, um, so we don't look like a nasty little sweaty rat, a quick outfit of the day. If you're curious, this is one of my favorite workout tops um, for years now. I always go back to it. It's my favorite long sleeve one. It's from Free People Movement. I'm not even wearing like a sports bra under because that's the thing I hate about a lot of long sleeve workout tops is you still, they're so thin, you still have to wear a bra under. And obviously like the boobs are like not as perky as they could be, but I like how it's compressive enough and it has this little slit, the thumb holes. It's so cute. And then my leggings are some ribbed ones from Lululemon. Camera shower. We have showered. We have thrown some makeup on. My hair is still wet back here, but I literally just blow dried my bangs. So they looked like presentable. Also, I totally didn't realize that I don't have my spray tan anymore so my foundation does not match the rest of my body but we're gonna blend her out. Today is pretty chill. It's raining. It's been like flooding here in LA. So on top of it being a rainy day it's a really chill day so that's why I'm just like literally in sweats and barely bothered getting ready. First we are gonna make lunch because I am hungry. That workout be workouting. Today we are making the crispy Parmesan chicken. Today's video is sponsored by HelloFresh. I always would say that it's so nice if you live by yourself because you have all the ingredients you could ever need. Like everything is portioned out. Once I started grocery shopping for just myself, I realized how much I, like things go bad a lot. I feel like I already am buying way less groceries, but on top of it, the things are still going bad just because I'm used to having roommates who also eat all the groceries. So having everything pre-portioned out is amazing. It also comes with step-by-step -step recipes. Obviously today we're doing the chicken and then the other day Ashley and I actually made the flautas which were so good. Blah, 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 blah. Bring medium pot of salted water to a boil. Step one is done. In a small bowl, combine panko, parmesan, paprika. All right, panko. Large drizzle of olive oil. What's a large drizzle? I think that's too much. <laughs> Salt and pepper. Dry with paper towels. Check. I would have never known this is how you make it. Adding chicken to air fryer. Good for six. <gasps> We're good. <laughs> okay, wife me up. This looks so good. Hot. I love couscous. It's like little pasta balls, but it's rice. My two favorite things in one. Hot, <laughs> but it's really good. So whether you live alone or not, and you want bomb meals that are super affordable. Date night, date night on a budget. So if you want 65% off plus free shipping, just go to hellofresh.com and enter code AliciaMarie65. I'm gonna eat lunch and I'll update you. Probably editing. Good morning, everybody. How are we doing this morning? Just got back from the gym. We're kind of working with the cream vibes today, which I did not plan, but we got our Stanley Cup. I don't think it's overrated. I'm just gonna be honest. I love mine. Also just had breakfast and I kind of smell, so I'm gonna go shower. <laughs> we showered. I was running out the door because I actually am headed to a my first ever laser appointment for like, um, 
hair removal laser appointment and I am kind of excited. I feel like I've been wanting to do this for a really long time. Hopefully it doesn't hurt. I've heard mixed reviews. Um, hoping it doesn't, but I need to be there in like 10 minutes and we're right around the corner. So hopefully we find parking. <laughs> That was the easiest thing ever. I barely felt anything. And I know the first one you don't feel much, but like so far, big fan. It also only took like maybe five minutes, like 10 minutes max. So we love that. Since there's an Alfred across the street, you know I'm about to get myself a matcha. You all really let me know that, um. Boom roasted is from the office last time that I said that and everyone was pissed I didn't know. All right, we're headed home now. Don't get hit by a car, Alicia. Also, I, I think someone paid my meter or I'm dumb and didn't notice this. I realized when I got here, I didn't have my wallet because I left it at Remy's. So I was like, shoo, I'm gonna park here and I'm gonna get a ticket. But I was like, I don't know what else I can do because I, like, I don't have cash on me, which this is a reminder to have at least a little cash on me. I wasn't that long, but it was definitely like at least 30 minutes, 30, 40 minutes. So I was expecting there to be a ticket on my car when I got back and the meter's green. It says I have nine minutes left. So I'm like, did was it paid for when I parked here and didn't notice there was time left over? I feel like I would have noticed. And now I kind of want to like pay that forward for people if I ever see their meter out so they don't get a ticket. It's kind of like buying the Starbucks in front of them, but like paying their meter. I know this only applies to like city situations. Anytime anyone comes to LA, the main thing they always say is like, how do you deal with having to pay to park everywhere? And honestly, the answer is, I don't know. I think you just kind of get used to it, but I genuinely was expecting to get a ticket and I didn't. The next time I pass someone's meter and it's red, I'm paying it. Oh no, my battery's at 4%. I think I have a charged battery somewhere. I just need to find it. You guys are being so proud of me. I've been getting so much work done today. Um, I even started filming my first video of 2023 on my main channel. It's so weird because I have obviously not been uploading on that channel, but I feel like I finally, I don't know. There's been a lot of like internal stuff going on and I finally feel like I have the mental capacity to kind of like focus on that and what I want to do and just filming and content more. Um, if you guys, I know you guys love seeing the behind the scenes of my meeting in my manager's office um, talking about like 2023 goals and stuff. So if you haven't watched that, you should watch it. But I basically was saying that I'm really excited to just like make content again and like get back to kind of where I started with stuff because I really do love it. All last year, I feel like I was very much just like, what do I want to be uploading on my main channel? Even just balancing all the platforms from like TikTok, shorts, YouTube, main channel, vlog channel, tic uh, or is it TikTok, Instagram, Snapchat, like all these things. It's like, it's always hard figuring out what content goes where, which I know I've said before. It's a podcast. Like there's always so much. So obviously the main channel took a little back um went on the back burner this past year but i'm excited to start uploading again i don't think it'll be weekly videos because there's just so much going on but even like bi-weekly videos like uploading once every other week i would love that would love it but we'll get there okay what am i doing importing editing wow And welcome to Remy's 28th Drop It Like It's Yacht birthday extravaganza. Who's ready to party? <laughs> We're getting ready. What eye look are you doing? I was just looking, I think a bronze smoke. I just a dark smoky eye. A black would slay. Yeah. I feel like with I this outfit, like it would look so okay, good. Let's do it. Let's see you. <laughs> I love the flip. Cute. It's so cute. I like can't. I don't even know how to do this. I'm glad we did the bangs out. Me too. I love your bangs. Are you ever gonna grow them out? Honestly, I don't ever really want to, but I feel like I'll have to just to change it up. You know. Yeah. The glam is done, and Rem's glam just got done. She like. Hi, vloggy vlog. Mm. Mm. What's it like being hot, rich, has a G-Wagon, throwing a yacht party? <laughs> Fabulous, honestly. <laughs> when you put it that way, honestly, really great. Oh my God. What the heck? <laughs>
Damn, yeah, my photos don't just delete all the ones I took of you. Please send me better. Happy birthday! Thank you. Happy birthday month. Thank you to my social media coordinator for getting Excuse such me. great content of me today. <laughs> I have to keep telling myself. Marathon. She travels with me. Can we get an outfit of the day? Yes. My dress is from, also, I believe it's Wolf and Badger. Yeah. My Spanx are from Honey Love. Love. My shorts are neither from Lululemon. My shoes are gifted to me by Alicia Marie. Ah, I didn't show them yet. Yeah, put that on my wiki feed. Yeah, I will. Turn around and stars. pop the foot. Pop the foot? Yes! Yes! That's Step all I'm wearing. So. Oh, and the ring is from Objects. Slay mama. Slay mama. I'm gonna do an outfit today and I realize I don't know where anything is because this jacket is Ollie's. Jacket is from Urban. Where is this from? I don't know. This ring. Oh my ass. That's from Mama Marie. <laughs> I don't know where my dress is from, but I'll look it up and I'll put it right here. Literally just type in silver dress. Gatekeeper. I think it was like 200 bucks. No, I'll Gatekeeper. find it. I'll look it up. I'll look Gatekeeper. it up. I got it from net a -Porte, and it is by the brand Rotate Berger Chris Jensen. Hemley strapless silver dress. It was $2.90. And I'm wearing my favorite black Stuart Weitzman heels. Slay. Insane. Um... Me as if this light does anything for the boat. <laughs> I was like, <laughs> what the fuck, dude? Smiley way, boys. This bitch. <laughs> she said, welcome to, to Romy's Cabaret, <laughs> where your wish it is her command. Whatever you desire. Okay, we have to take more photos out here, sorry. Okay. Doing my job. Remy Cruz, yeah. over here. This orange light's not doing it for me, but you know what? We have our own light. This is massive. Hi! Hi! How are you? Good to see you. Oh my god, should I open it now? Yes! Okay. I want to see your genuine expression <laughs> when you open the door.